Hey everybody, it's Army Guy E8. Welcome back to World of Tanks console, baby. Modern armor. Woo! -wee! Today we're here on lovely Nippleburg, and we're here to take a look at the new premium Japanese Tier 8 tank destroyer, the Type 5 Kari. This is the first Japanese tank destroyer in this game, and I would assume that the new tank tree should be following soon. Update. The information on the new Japanese tank destroyer tech tree line has been released. It appears it goes from a tier 3 Horu, which I like. That means you get an entire tech tree line to grind out and become more proficient with. All the way up to the tier 10 tank, the Hori 3. And there's also a premium tier 6 in there as well. Here's the article if you want to read more about all the details. You can currently earn this tank by completing stage 100 of the Season 24 Tigers Season Pass. You can also earn a skin for this tank earlier in the season by completing stage 37. So, if you purchase the Season Pass, make sure and go into the Appearance tab once you get this tank, and select it and mount it on your vehicle. It's a pretty good looking skin for this tank. It's better than the regular old paint jobs, and I'm glad they gave it to us to earn. When I don't forget, I do like to go over and check out the World of Tanks console, Modern Armor, 10 Year Celebrations website, and see how I'm doing on the current season pass. Here we go, completed the season, got the Type 5, Kari. Tiger season pass unlocked. We took this tank in a battle 55 times. We had a high 63% win rate. We averaged a combined damage per battle of 2,706, and we earned one ace tanker, baby. So here's the bluff. The bottom line up front. This tank's okay. It's very average and nothing special. But being a turretless tank destroyer in today's fast-paced gameplay does cause it to suffer. Let's go take a look at the details, and I want to see this steadfast driver in my office. Come here, hero! is all about. Interesting. What do you want? How are you this fine day, sir? I said, what do you want? Uh, I'm in straight to business. I like that. One ticket, please. A ticket? A ticket for what? I'd like to see your ship show and take a ride on one of those. No rides. We're closed today, buddy. Are you sure? There's an awful lot of people out there. Oh, wait, wait, We're busy. No rides. Is there anybody else I could talk to? Hold on, you j What's that? Rude. Yeah, what do you want, man? Yes, sir. I'd like to get... Hey, wait a minute. Ain't you the same guy? Ain't I what, bro? What? Ah, never mind. I'd like to get one ticket for the ship show and to take a ride, please. We're closed. Going away, man. Well, what about that guy? He's getting in. He doesn't have a ticket. He was here before. He got the last ticket, bro. But I drove all night. I really want to see your ship show. Oh, my God. Bye-bye. Ah, it's so nice and relaxing out here, and I love the fresh sea air. 
Let's take a look at the details. The tank's origins. From 1942, Japanese engineers began to take an active interest in German tanks in general, as well as their components. By 1943, a large amount of materials was accumulated, which served as basis for their own projects, one of which was going to be the Type 5 Kari Heavy Tank Destroyer. This very powerful armament would have allowed it to hit any tank, and its thick frontal armor would have provided reliable protection from most tank destroyers. The presence of such a vehicle would have significantly strengthened Japan's defense potential, but its development began too late. It existed only in blueprint due to the end of the war. All right, I don't think anybody sees this yet, so let's keep going and take a look at the numbers. The speed gets up to 40 kilometers an hour, which is pretty good. The gun size is 12.7 centimeters, also known as 127 millimeters. The reload time coming out of the factory was 14.3 seconds per shot. We get ours down to 10.4. The rate of fire is 4.2 rounds per minute starting out. We got ours up to 5.75, which is not bad for a tier 8 tank destroyer. That gives you a damage per minute of 2,100, but we got ours up to 2,875, again, based off our tank setups. The accuracy started out at a pretty good 0.34, but we got ours down to an amazing 0.28. You have a two second aim time and you have negative seven degrees of gun depression, which is okay. It's not bad. It's better than average. The Alpha ammo is AP. It'll pen 252 millimeters of enemy armor and it has a shell velocity that's almost a little bit too slow at 980 meters a second. But the premium Bravo ammo is APCR. It'll pen a great 298 millimeters of enemy armor and it also has a great shell velocity of 1,150 meters a second. Both the Alpha and Bravo ammo do 500 hit points of damage on average per shot. Now, I'm gonna get a ride on one of these things whether they like it or not. There you go, closer. That's a nice looking paint job. It's a pretty sharp looking tank. All right, how do we get up here on this? Look out! I got something for you, Steadfast. Stay right there. The frontal turret armor thickness is between 100 and 300 millimeters. The frontal hull armor thickness is between 70 and 115 millimeters. This tank's armor is okay on the front face of the turret, which is the strongest and thickest part. But the hull armor is a little bit weak, in my opinion. It can block shots if you're hauled down from tier 6s through 8s and some tier 9s. But there's going to be a lot of tanks that will pen you with their premium ammo, including almost every tier 10. It's huge. Front, upper plate is hard to hide. And it's not very strong. All right, the commander that we've got in this tank destroyer is the unwaveringly loyal Gunpai Takata. And the skills that he's running are six cents, situational awareness, and camouflage expertise. Born leader, rapid loading, and steady aim. And the next three commander skills are the most important, in my opinion, for any tank destroyer commander. Green thumb, silent driving, and muffled shot. We're also running the standard tank destroyer equipment that I like. Optics, advanced loader, a camo net, and of course, enhanced targeting information. Woo-wee! The Type 5 Kyrie's gun offers you incredible alpha damage with equally impressive penetration values. Its mobility also stands out. Easily take the best position on the battlefield as soon as possible, despite being a tank destroyer and trust your armor to bounce a shot or two. Now let's get this tank onto the battlefield and go find that steadfast.
I'm in speed. Ooh. <laughs> Thank you, Raymond. How long do you think it's been since you've been in your game profile? Curious what it'll have waiting on you. smoke and make sure you're going to try cold war 2 we're going to play a cold war battle here pretty soon modern armor been a long time chew gum and cause damage and I'm all out of gum Oh, yeah. Ooh, that was a little bit low, but it hit. Need to get that scorpion out of there. He's a little troublemaker. Those scorpions can be a problem. Good tank. Good tank. Leo! Try and track this guy. Get more damage. Somebody hit his track. Dog on it. Go, go, go. Get out there. Keep going. Don't stop. Ah. We'll go undetected in a second. Good game. We need three more pens. We need to hit 5,000 damage. Like I always keep wanting to do, but never get. It was tied 8-8, eight eight, now it's 5. 8-5, that's good. We can get up here and get some shots in. We need two more good pens. Please, game, please. Don't get me one-shotted by the arty. Okay, one more. One more. Can we hit 5,000 damage? No, we're still low. 4960. It's two. 
Ho! Artie's on the back left. We know where all the last three tanks are. We need another pen. Come on, turn, turn. Line it up, snap it, pow. Got it, got 5,400. I just kicked the dog. <laughs> He's gonna bite me. Top gun wasted. Ah. Lost the top gun. Dang it. Dang it. Artie's back here. I rushed that shot. That could have been a top gun. Right there. Nice. Nice. Come on, baby. Come on. Woo! 7,000 combined with five kills. I'm happy with that. Oh, baby. 2,110 XP. <clears throat> Is 2,110 XP good enough for a first class? Oh, that could have been a top gun, but we hit so much. That worked out perfectly. Learn to aim. MVP. Seven medals. What tier? That was a uh, tier eight. We're going to go to tier 10 tank destroyers if this is an ace. <sighs> yes. Yes. Boom, 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 boom. There we go, baby. Woo -wee. I'm happy with that. Finally. Finally a good battle. <laughs> oh, mark it. Clip it. Ah. Uh.